Creek Catholic Church in West Bend. Our church operates a parish school kindergarten in grade three. If you're members of the school board, I'd like to enter into the public record my opposition of this proposal to enter into contract with Crossroads Academy Charter School. I offer this opposition on the grounds that I fear greatly the deleterious effects that the presence of such a charter school could and likely would have on the enrollment and thus stability of St. Francis Cabrini Catholic School and the other parochial or church-based schools serving this community. Common sense alone suggests the threat posed when parochial schools struggling to contain the rising cost of tuition in the face of increasing economic hardship are forced to compete with an alternative school that promises similar educational values and philosophy without cost. This common sense is further bolstered by recent research. A study published by the National Center for the Study of Privatization of Education indicates that private schools lose one student for every three students gained in charter school. Also cited in the study are cases where competition from tuition-free charter schools force parochial schools to drop their religious affiliation and curriculum and convert to charter school status themselves in order to survive. I fear the prospect of similar negative consequences for our community should the Board of Education implement this proposal for Crossroads Academy Charter School, consequences with the potential to devastate the legacy of parochial school education in West Bend. The legacy of parochial school education in West Bend is both historic and remarkable. For example, my own congregation school, St. Francis Cabrini, and Good Shepherd Lutheran School, are the new kids on the block, yet we trace our foundations to 1957 and 1963, respectively. St. John's Lutheran School has been educating students in this community since 1872. Holy Angels Catholic School has been doing the same since 1866. And Immaculate Conception St. Mary's is one of the oldest Catholic schools in the nation still operating on its original site, which it has done since 1850. This community has been blessed by generation after generation of citizens who have graduated with exemplary education from parochial schools. I humbly ask you, the members of the Board of Education, not to place this legacy at risk. Not place at risk the choice that we parochial schools offer this community.